Very little is needed to make a happy life. Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am going to do my affirmations. I'm outside even though it's a little cold and windy. I like being outside and there's rain coming in the next two days. So I want to enjoy this last day of nice weather. I can control and change my future with my thoughts. My thoughts control and form my reality. And though I am conscious of everything going on around me in the world, I am choosing to feed my mind good, healthy, prosperous thoughts. Because my mind is a goal-seeking organism, I am feeding it good, healthy, prosperous goals daily. I am worthy to receive. I draw financial abundance to me. Money comes in expected and unexpected ways. I am a good person and a great friend to all who know me, and I love myself more today than yesterday. I am focusing on what I really want in life and not what I do not want. I am gladly releasing any excess weight from my body, and I willingly release any other addictions from my mind and body to be a healthier me. If you see the pup running around, she's just getting some free time and exercising in the park here. I am responsible for my own life and the choices I make and the consequences thereof. I do not get upset very easy. If I get upset, it's because I feel like you have either called me a liar or a thief. Either one, I am not a liar or a thief. I understand things differently than most people. And that's who I am. So I won't ever, I will not tolerate being called a liar or a thief. I will just stop talking to that person. Um, I've lost lots of people because I feel like they called me a liar or a thief, either one. I don't need anything from anybody. I am perfectly content to live here. Just the way I am, I'm perfectly fine. That antique, antique uh, cement mixer, it really works, still works. I poured most of my cement pillars with it when my son was up here. And uh, I've had a couple people try to buy it. I don't want to sell it. I'll just let it sit there until we need it again. Um, I'm trying to think, I am calm. I am calm and peaceful and I draw peace to me. I draw powerful healing energies to me and I can do anything, anything is possible with God's grace as long as it is God's will. I am blessed, I am truly blessed and I am grateful. Gratitude is part of my everyday existence. The moment my feet hit the floor, I am thanking God for letting me have that moment, for letting me be able to sit up for letting me be able to stand up every moment, every ache and pain from the last couple of weeks of work. I am thanking God for that because I'm grateful to have the ability to do that, to still be able to do things that my parents weren't able to do at that time, or at least my, my mother was not able to do these things at this age. So I am grateful for every moment that I get to move and every moment that I can keep walking I want to walk until I can no longer walk, which will hopefully not be until I'm nine feet under. I want to continue to move every part of my body. I am grateful for the air that I breathe, even with this inversion, which makes it more difficult to breathe. I am very grateful for the air that I breathe, and I am grateful for this day, and I am grateful to be alive, and I am grateful for my loving family and my caring friends. I am grateful for running water and electricity and I am so grateful to all of my family and friends who have blessed me in so many ways. I am grateful for each and every one of you taking time out of your day to spend here with me listening to my ramblings. I am visualizing, I am visualizing my successes in achieving my goals one by one. I am 
visualizing my successes in achieving my goals one by one. Other people get upset over other things, silly things, you know, like my daughter. She gets very upset, hostile, if she feels like anyone is attacking the family in any way, shape, or form. That, even if it doesn't bother me, it bothers her. Um, I get upset, basically only over a couple of things. I know people talk crap about me, and I'm okay with that. They ain't bothering me any. And all they're doing is hurting themselves, but um, the only things that bother me is if someone calls me a liar or a thief, because I am neither one of those things. Those things bother me immensely. And I have been called that by two different men in my lifetime. One that I know personally and one that I know through YouTube. So <clears throat> those things offended me. Nothing else offended me. Everybody is, is entitled to their own opinions on everything. I am superior to negative thoughts and emotions and I will overcome all negativity and succeed. I am strong and I am healthy and I am full of energy. I am confident, I am kind, I am courageous, I am brave and I am unique. I am one of a kind. I am loving and I am loved. Blossom, don't eat that. Blossom, no, leave it. Come on, come on. Sorry, she's eating the logs for the fire pit, which we're gonna burn them up next week probably. As soon as they turn on my outside water, I can't really burn a fire until they turn on the water. I am amazing. I am enough. I am more than enough. I am focused. I am driven. Get out of my onions, dog. I'm going to put you on a cable. Oh my goodness. I got to go play with her. I got to finish this. Focus. I am focused. I am driven. I am successful. I am worthy. I am optimistic. I am compassionate. I am beautiful. I am creative, I am sensitive, I am generous, I am kind, I am loyal, I am a survivor, and I am honest, and I am fun, and I am thoughtful, and I am empathetic. Empathetic. It's, it's funny because empathetic. I can feel things, the different energy from different people. I can feel when a child's hurting, I can know what's hurting them. When a person is doing something they shouldn't do, I can know that too. Unfortunately, I can't always decipher where the energies are coming from, if they're near or far. Sorry, the camera ran out of space. I am superior to negative thoughts and emotions, and I will overcome all negativity and succeed because I am guided in my every step and my every word by my Heavenly Father who leads me towards my future and showing me what I must do and what I must know. And I pray that you all and all of humanity stay safe and healthy. And may God bless you with abundance, good health, and prosperity. In Jesus' name, amen. Simplicity is the exact medium between too little and too much.